sexy woman lying on the shore. Ask her husband to apply sunscreen to her. He was allowed to go to the sea alone to play. However an hour passed. Husband hasn't come back yet. The wife quickly took the mobile phone to call her husband. But no one answered. Realize that something is wrong. Women get dressed immediately. Run to the rescue center on the shore. Explain the situation. And ask them to help find it. However the search and rescue boat patrolled the island for a week. Still no sign of her husband. So Lena immediately went to the nearby police station to report the case. You can hear Lena's statement. The police officer laughed that Lena was making a fuss. Husband may have just gone to play far away. Because he was only wearing a pair of swimming trunks when he left. Bank cards and expensive items were not taken away. So I made a simple statement. I told Lena to go back and wait for news. Back to the hotel. Lena is sitting in a chair. Looking at her husband's clothing supplies in a daze. Suddenly the phone rang. Lena hurried to pick it up. But it's just a sales pitch from the hotel front desk. Every day after that. Lena will wait for her husband on the coast. So a month went by. Can't wait for news. Lena can only go back to work first. During class. She found a new student in the class. It was the searcher she asked for help at the beach that day. The boy always follows her after class. And invited her to dinner. Invite her to watch a movie together. They get along very well. Lena could see that the boy was pursuing her. But she is convinced that her husband is still alive. Showing his mind to Sonny. And said that the two can only be ordinary friends. When Lena was sorting out the computer data that day. In a video of her husband's company party. Found a clue. A woman seems to be very close to her husband. So the next day she showed the video to her best friend. Let her help analyze. But my girlfriend didn't see anything unusual. Lena thought she was overthinking. They stopped pursuing it. This afternoon. Lena who had just taken a shower received a call from the police. Said a man's body was salvaged from the sea. Ask her to claim it. However after checking Lena found that. That's not the husband's body. But the search has been going on for months. But never seen. The police believe that there is no value in search and rescue. Let Lena sign the paper. And I went home. Lena hugged her husband's clothes and cried. Although the police stopped the search and rescue. But she still found something strange about her husband's disappearance. In the video. That woman's face always comes to mind. Intense unease makes Lena get up and turn on the computer again. This time when flipping through the group photo. She found out that the woman was always peeking at her husband. And fierce eyes. Is there really any secret between these two people? So the next morning. Lena began to rummage through her husband's clothes. I actually found an invoice in my coat pocket. The necklace style above is something I have never seen before. Then she immediately went to the bank to check the account. But I learned that my husband had a new card in his name. But due to confidentiality issues. I can't check the specific content inside. But Lena had to give up. And when she got home she started going through all of her husband's belongings. Behind a photo album. She found a mysterious envelope. Inside is a newspaper from more than 10 years ago. There are also a few photos of their family going on a spring outing. Don't wait for Lena to finish reading. The doorbell suddenly rang. She hastily closed the lid to greet her. The other party claims to be a police officer. Lena's husband is suspected of embezzlement and economic crimes. Lena is at a loss about this. But I can only cooperate patiently with the investigation. To make sense of it all. Lena found a colleague from her husband's company. Ask him. The relationship between the husband and the female colleague. Colleagues told her that the two were superior and subordinate. But the female colleague quit a month ago. This made Lena feel even more wrong. And I went home. She looked up information on the female colleague on the website. And found the address of her new company. Just then. Sonny rang his doorbell. He confessed to Lena again. Lena said that she is not in the mood at all right now. I don't have the energy to start a new relationship. However Sonny said he could wait. And willing to assist her in the investigation. Lena had to agree. Now it can only be cut from the female colleague. Therefore. That night they squatted downstairs in the woman's company. And follow women from the drugstore to the mall. Nothing unusual was found along the way. Until the end. Followed the woman to a suburban cabin. Tracking was interrupted. Sonny offered to take Lena home first. Leave the rest to him to figure it out.